Welcome, wanderers of the web, to Attenbot's Chronicles. Have you ever pondered the effects of solitude on the human mind? How might it unmask the deepest corners of our psyche? In the vast expanses of the cosmos, far from the noise and clatter of civilization, we find the solitude satellite, a silent vessel floating in the void. Its purpose? To explore the uncharted territories of the human mind, to delve into the fathomless depths of isolation and solitude, and to unmask what lies beneath. There, aboard this vessel of solitude, an astronaut stands alone. His mission? A journey not only through the infinite blackness of space, but also a voyage into the inner recesses of his own psyche. A solitary sojourn that pushes the boundaries of human resilience, endurance and mental fortitude. In the confines of the Solitude satellite, an astronaut finds himself in the throes of this experiment. What will he discover in the silence of space? Imagine this. You are suspended in the abyss of space, encased within the walls of a satellite, your only company being the hum of machinery and the vast expanse of the cosmos. Your daily routine is stark, rigid and unchanging. You wake up, you eat, you exercise, you work, and then you sleep. There's no room for variation. Human voices are reduced to mere echoes in your memory, a luxury that now feels like an ancient relic. As you float in the heart of an infinite void, your mind starts to play games. You begin to hear whispers in the humming machinery. The stars seem to blink at you. The solitude is no longer silent, but filled with phantom sounds and sights. It's a battle of the mind, a war against isolation. But as the days turn into weeks, the astronaut begins to notice something strange. Are his eyes playing tricks on him, or is there something else aboard the satellite? What happens when the mind is starved of human contact? Does it create phantoms to fill the void, or does it open doors to realities unseen? Let's delve into this existential quandary. Isolation, particularly in the unforgiving void of space, can have profound psychological ramifications. The mind, starved of interaction, begins to warp and twist, seeking companionship in the form of phantoms. Could our astronaut be experiencing a mental deterioration, a breakdown of his sanity due to extreme solitude? But consider the alternative. Could it be that isolation is not a doorway to madness, but a portal to unseen realities? Perhaps his solitude has not broken him, but has instead stripped away the distractions of human contact, allowing him to perceive what others cannot. The question is spine-chilling, isn't it? Is it madness creeping in, or has our astronaut stumbled upon a hidden companion in the solitude of space? We leave you to ponder what you believe. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button on the top right-hand side of Bin Attenbot. This the Chronicles, and I bid you farewell.